welcome again welcome my friends uh, today I want to explore a little bit of karma I render uh, a very quick scene because my issue was uh, when I render with mantra and Ibiro simulation it will take ages very very strong very powerful but very slow I went to Clarice very nice excellent but I'm missing the option of the of the uh, biro shader still maybe I need to learn more so this is my take on my first render in karma for the biro simulation I just render uh, 40 frames I will walk you through the scene and have a look yeah okay so let's jump to Houdini I'll just show you the file here um, uh, you just started with the sphere I just remove the other object, just a sphere, and I scatter 500 points. Then I pack the sphere so I have the center point. I group it, just I put a new name. Which I, uh, I add it here in the point warp. The idea here is just I want this particle to have a velocity to go all the way to the to the middle to the center. You have many ways, but I was just exploring, so I, I, I come up with this one. It's straightforward, nothing extraordinary. I subtracted the current position of the points from the center this one so sub extracted then I negate because otherwise it will shoot out so I make it shoot in and I have a multiplier and I plugged in, in through the velocity and the multiplier just to make it faster okay then I went to the pop net but before that I created a torus and in the torus I make if I plug it in the normal value let me show you <coughs> what I did I played with the normal of that uh, torus it's just pointing outside I make a double cross product I multiply it then I ended up with the normals being uh, little bit up I want it to go see this one up this one just to create some randomness uh, on the surface which I use it in the pop network the pop network also I have the helix here also I created one quick helix I tap it a little bit and I put another here just uh, something fast just to create some interesting shape in the pyro that's the whole point so it is just the input all the points less than 20 and just for 3 seconds should be less here I created uh, this variable let me go to the not solaris go to the build sheet okay so let's divide this one top to bottom not like this full and here I want to divide split pan top and bottom and here I want my spreadsheet pop geometry so on the pop angle I created full where is full? This is full. This one. So 
what will Fu do? It will measure the distance because this particle will start to move so it will measure the distance in each frame between the point that center point and store it as a Fu so if you look here let's take this one to start 1.27 then start to decrease 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 then when it reach the target it will increase again okay so why i use this one i store this uh, attribute this is just a drag i color it any particle with less distance than 0.5 put it in a group which i call it repairs and i use this group only to be affected by curve force the curve is the helix this one the red one another crazy color output so too many different shapes you can use but i went with this one and i make it very strong with the follow and the suction all these kind then i moved out i created a circle at the bottom scatter some points which we offset it merge them both together look like this then i created my pyro source in the pyro source I choose point otherwise because it's point if I didn't choose point it will not work here I create three attributes the way I created I went to the initial and used per per temperature density why I didn't put velocity no I should put let's add velocity Density on custom velocity. Let's see, let's go here. Okay, attribute randomize. I randomize the velocity, then I rasterize. Let's have a look. See, sorry for the miss. Now in the barrel solver, a couple of things I did. Just wait for it to load. Okay. So here uh, I should think decrease this uh, voxel size when I render out. I close the button for the solving. Simulation is okay. I went down very low with the Beyonce. I make it 3 so it lasts for longer I emitted smoke rate of 10 added temperature and expansion I make it 9 so it will go outward like an explosion in the shape the space I left it as alone I increase the disturbance shredding and turbulence sourcing also we added the velocity let's have a look ah before we have a look I went inside here I copied the helix uh, care force and add it here and increase it so it will affect also the pyro gas vortex confinement also added to give it the swirly movement and a little bit of wind very low so let's have a look this one will look different than the one I render I think maybe this one will be better hopefully This one, see how it move, rotate. 
that's what I was searching for. We should break up this uh, mushroom now, but I like them for this effect, so that's why I'm keeping them also this small one. Let me try to go down a little bit with the dissipation, turbulence. Turbulence, let's make it with the will and see the difference. The one that I cache is this one. By the way, when I render out, I render out here exported as uh, VDB. Okay? No, let me bypass this one and see how it will look with the pyro volume. In the pyro volume, the smoke I make it 30. Let's make it and see. Let's make it 300. That's too much. 80. Here I put 0.8. Density of the shadow 10. Back to 1. Scatter I make it 1000. Here from point one, if I put point eight, see, so it will where it will cut. So if I make it zero, take all of it. If I make it point nine, this part of it. So if I make this one point one to point one five, all of it. So make this one two. Make this one one because I have a fire here. Switch it off. So make this one one and make this one point nine nine. Let me uh, switch off this camera and put the fire. Fire, let's increase it and I'll make it from point nine. See, the fire is inside here. So if, if we view. 
brightness I'll decrease the smoke and make it 20 if I went down to up to 5 maximum is 1 but here if I make it 7 you start to see if I make this one 5 even more nice so I'll keep this one at five mask center increase it and we'll blend it I don't want that up now let's go to the scatter scatter and make it default default and start to play its intensity nice okay so we'll blur it a little bit no need no need for the mask center see how it's scatter very cool Okay, <coughs> now you have two options. You can render in Mantra, which uh, take ages. So I went down with Karma. Still, I'm uh, exploring uh, Solaris, so this is just my first take. Yani. Too many things to learn. So you can export the whole uh, animation as one file USD, but the way I did it, I just imported there. So, here in the build, I go to Solaris. And in Solaris, I need to go here to the stage. Look, immediately it, it rendered. <coughs> so, my setup just. Uh, basic one I imported the whole scene there is also sub import but I imported everything I added the material and the material the way I went through because the pyro volume baker or pyro baker volume inside it there is the man the material net and the pyro shader this is the one I wanted and I wanted to the volume see Geometry volume because these are this layer like uh, Windows folder. Then I just added the camera, close, merged everything together just for organization, and added two lights here and here just to see the difference. Bypass, bypass, you can see the scattering. Here, when you open it, it will be with uh, OpenGL like this. Even this one looks cool. And to process it, you, whatever uh, render plugin you have, it will show up here. I disabled the uh, render man because uh, with render man and V-Ray, whoever at the bottom will be activated. So I don't know how to make both of them be live or linked. And I added a karma node. In karma node, <coughs> important things I learned the sampling. I went down, yeah, like well, instead of 120 or 100, I just make it 10 or 8. I decrease the limit because my scene is empty. Let me put back the lighting. Also, the cool thing is this one the denoise. See the noise we have? If you go to the filter, I mean, output filter. And with the noise, no denoise. See how it's very noisy with this uh, low quality sitting. See, firefly. But when I put the unveil here, let's give it a moment. Still rendering. 
say very cool because this is low res but it's nice let's go to frame 50 and see very quick very 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 quick really very fast optimized now if i win pump up this one to let's say 50 we already start to see mm, render karma render property what's this I need to explore more karma. See, already half of it. Already you can see a foot. So to render out, just like mantra, the render range, the file extension, you choose your camera and the resolution and you hit render. So let's say let's do it in Clarice. So I'll just go to Clarice here. New geometry. We need a volume. It's a file. I'll point it to wherever I saved it. Cache. Did I save it as VDB? Oh. I remember my mistake here. Yeah, in the stage object geometry. <coughs> when I save it, the file cache, I save it as PJO. So let me let me uh, save it as a VDB. I'll come back in a second. So I rendered the 70 frame at the resolution of 0 0.08 here. Let me write it also. Let me quick. Anyway, I'll go to Clarice. Here, I'll open the file. Desktop. Here, file the cache. And this is the VDB. And I want it to be a sequence. File sequence. Detect. Detect. 69.70. Same. Okay. So let me just scroll here. Okay, so this is the file. I need a volume. So new, right click new material, material, volume. Okay, I'll drop it on the file. And let's open here. What do we call it? This one material editor so this is the volume and I need the uh, uh, black body and I want uh, the utility I forget its name extract property okay so the one I'm seeking is flame and I want to pump the temperature and this one in the emission Am I doing it correctly? Let's see. Volume, black body, volume. Volume, artistic. Density multiplier, emission, libido, attenuation. And here I'm taking the flame. And this is the black body. Is it connected? Let's uh, see the linker. Put this aside. <coughs> So this is the file and it's the volume. Okay. 
Actually, I'm still learning Clarice. to be cloud smoke See, I need to learn it more and read even I went to and read let's put this one black okay. I go to the last frame. them to be black, the smoke to be black. So, albedo. I think I found it. It's the remap. one more and see how to make it work better 
because I need to read more about it. Okay, but if we go back here, I already saved it. So reload geometry. Let's go to frame 49. Tab yeah, to look. See? Very cool. If I uh, jump to Solaris, where is Solaris? Solaris stage. Let's give it a second. Look. Let me go back with the camera. The nice way I, sh I, I remember there is light uh, lister mixer, light mixer, this one. Yeah, so light mixer you can put all slides, yeah, light one, light two, light three. This one I can just switch it off. They only have the HDRI. Let's cook it now. Still cooking while it cook. I will add another material. Material library. I want to add material for the background. This one. So here, the background, let me just take it up on this one, OpenGL, mm, it's frozen, okay, so the one I need is you know I should name my stuff ah background stage so here pd this one so we go to the material that right makes ah. material I'll just choose material, uh, material path pd here inside, I'll create another material, principal shader. Make it darker or brownish. Maybe a bit like this. Let's see. Go up. Material drop. Material path, sorry, see? So assign to geometry, this one. Without it, I think I added too much purple. I think I 
I will go with the brownie. Yes. Now let me. So instead of going here, I'll just go to the light mixer. What's this Python? I get rid of uh, I disable the light mixer giving me too much bugs. I'll just remove it. Let it refresh. Restart render. Go to my camera. start <clears throat> oh, it's the scene view was dead it was freezing so look through my camera give me karma and this go in here yeah now it's reading no because I turned this one off see my mistake need higher resolution what if I switch to this one this without the noise and it's on I think sample of 9 I'll stick with this one this one the 8 this is 15 
city, make it five. To one, and I take this one, right, and I make it ten. Let's see how it will affect this one. I make it. mixture of color so this one is rendering from far away I want to remove the denoiser and see how what effect will have There. I want to create it that it's more swirly like this, like that. It'll be nice. So, if it's mantra, it will take ages. This one, very nice, very fast. Good for look development. That's cool. Anyway, thank you very much for uh, bearing with me. And I hope you get some through the way. I'm learning too, exploring more, and I'm sharing uh, the things I find interesting with the community. Thank you very much.